you think DD is uh, living up to the hype so far? I, you know, this is the first time I ever saw him this spring, and he, he is defensively, I think you got to go back to Pokey Reese to see it, to see a guy in this camp that's been as good as him. He's he's fantastic. He's got a great arm. I was talking to Billy uh, Doran, and he, he said the thing about him is there's a lot of shortstops, and probably Billy Hamilton included, who can get to a lot of balls, but what do they do with them when they're that deep in the hole? He can throw them out, throw guys out. He's very impressive. Just uh, and, and talking to people about him, uh, he's really smart. You know, speaks four languages. I, you know, I. I can't see anyone else being the shortstop of the future. Just, just on this little bit of time, and you know, he made quite a few errors last year, and you know, he obviously has to hit. But I, I was very impressed with him. You think the bat's going to come around? You know, he hit, he hit fine last year. I think he hit 292 combined. Um, you know, he's 22 years old. Uh, you know, his average is probably going to go down a little, but he runs pretty well. I, you know, I think he's good enough defensively that he can, you know, hit 270 and not hurt you. Cool. Anybody else uh, from earlier in camp that may have been sent down that impressed you? You know, a bunch of them did actually. Uh, Corsino, Daniel Corsino, the pitcher, looked very good. Um, uh, Henry Rodriguez, another guy I was talking to, to Billy about, and he says, you know, this, this kid just carries himself so well. He's, he thinks he could, you know, hold his own in the major leagues right now as a hitter. Uh, you know, Soto's got great power. Looks very good at first base. Pretty impressive, considering they had to move him a couple of places to get him there. You know, he looks good. Um, I, I, I was just struck by the overall talent in um, in camp, given that they traded, you know, five or six of their top 20. So, you know, I, I think the I think what they've done recently is they've done much better internationally. You know, these guys are. If you look at the guys I spoke about, none of them are from the United States. Right. So that's something they didn't do in the past. I think that's really helped them. Um, you know, I think the talent level is pretty good.